Hi, welcome to Inspiration Daily for February 11th, 2022. I'm your host, Gina Greenlee. Hi, of GinaGreenlee.com. Today's inspiration is um, mini book, handmade book templates. I'm decluttering, I'm in, in what I call the final declutter. And uh, really, I've, I've been on this journey actually for a couple of decades, not really, well, yeah, it has been with intention. You know, when I first moved to Florida, I rented a house because I moved from my house, which I was trying to sell back in 2008. And so I had a 1500 square foot house. And so I rented a 1400 square foot house to fit my furniture, which, you know, in retrospect really wasn't a bad idea because it was, uh, it was a, it was a, a happy change, a welcome change to move to, to the Gulf Coast of Florida, but it was, you know, it was stressful to do that and to, to relocate, not knowing anybody and doing it on my own. So, um, <laughs> so I'm like, so I'm sitting in this 1400 square foot house, half of which I don't use. And I'm thinking, um, the only reason I'm in this house is because I need a place to fit my furniture because I didn't know what to do with, I had, I had to vacate my house because I was staging it. I had put it on the market for sale. So, um, so that was sort of the beginning. I was like, you know what? I just, I don't need all this furniture. I don't need two bedrooms. I don't, I don't need all this stuff. So then I moved to an apartment and then, you know, I was like, Ooh, so, you know, I had to start giving things away, selling things. And I sold a lot of things on Craigslist, which was a very pleasant experience. A lot of people talk about, Oh, oh you meet crazies or whatever. I didn't meet a single crazy. In fact, it was, I met a lot of really interesting people and had great conversations and it was, it, it was fun actually. So I've been on that journey. Uh, I had a lot of corporate relocations. So I had things come from different states and I was like, oh my God, well, at least I got everything in one state, but I needed to get storage. And then I, I was done with, I think I was in uh, offsite, you know, meaning not attached to my domicile, offsite storage in one of those storage cubes. And I was, and I'm thinking, no, I don't need to spend that money to house stuff that I don't even know what it is. So I went through it. I started going through it. So I've been on this journey for a while. So I, I don't have furniture. I mentioned that already, <laughs> except for the two chairs, the one that I'm sitting on, the one that's holding the light. And I have a big art table. The rest of the space is, is, is for, for possibilities. I just like the space of having open space for possibilities, both indoors and outdoors. So that's why I love living in uh, South Florida. I can be outdoors most of the year. So, uh, so as that, that's context for the decluttering. Um, so the big things I have to organize are papers. That's, that will be the next one that I'm talking about. Okay. You might hear my, my neighbors knocking. This is what happens when you live in an apartment. They, they, I don't know what they're doing, but they knock. I think they're, I think they're new people, like new to their apartment. So they're, you can hear the little tap, tap, tap. I don't know what they're doing. I, I, I imagine that they're hanging pictures and things like that, but you know, that's okay. So just so you know what the knocking is, I'm not going to stop this because of the knocking. So, um, so the, my big thing to organize right now, it, all of my projects, my art, my finished art projects, in process and materials. So I've mentioned in previous inspiration dailies, I talked about art practice. I talked about collage. It's one of my, one of my art practices, collage. I love mixed media. I write books. I make books, handmade books. And so, so this is a thing called, this is apparently a, a, a cigarette thing, a cigarette brand called American spirit. I don't know, but I was, I was somewhere, I think it, and this was, I was, I think I was pumping gas. This, I think I got this at a gas station and I saw this and I was like, Ooh, I just, I loved it because check this out. You have to check this out. Let me get, so the light's not crazy. Oh, here we go. So now you can see it. Yeah. So, oops. So you open this up like this, right? Oh my God. It's, it's like a surprise, like a cracker jack thing. And then for those of you who are old enough to remember Cracker Jack. And then it folds out and it's, it's about, you know, I don't smoke, 
but I'm like, oh my God, what an incredible template for a book, a handmade book. And <clears throat> in my last, mm, I just had an inspiration that I wasn't expecting. In my last Inspiration Daily, when I talked about the movie marketing placards that Blockbuster was giving away as it was experiencing its downsizing and demise, uh, I was, of course, my mind was going in a million different directions about what I could do with those placards, but I could make lar somewhat larger versions of this puppy with those, with that beautiful, with those beautiful, you know, I mean, they paid graph photographers and graphic designers and graphic artists a lot of money to design those marketing posters. I mean, that's, that's top grade, um, five-star artwork. And I could use that as uh, book covers, but anyway, so this is my template. So, so again, this is my decluttering adventure and I'm having so much fun. I resisted this for so long that I said, you have to get this done, Gina, so you have to make it fun. So that's one template. Another one is a birth, this is a birthday card that my college buddy made for me. I have one, I have exactly one college buddy. <laughs> I went to a commuter school, meaning I lived at home and I went to uh, you know college locally when I was living in New York City. And so I, I didn't go away to school, I didn't stay in a dorm. So. I was working and I put myself through college uh, and I was working. And uh, so I went to class, I did my homework when I was, and then I went to work and then I went to sleep and that was it. So I only had, I didn't really have time to make friends. So there was this one girl who's now a woman my age uh, who I, she kept showing up in all my classes. And it turns out we were in the same uh, undergraduate program, which was English, a being in English. So we got friendly. <laughs> that was the end of that. And I've known her for the last 40 years. So she, um, like me, she's an artiste. I mean, and we're all artists. Her thing is she loves, she does a lot. She has a lot of different art practices, but she makes, uh, she does handmade cards. And there's her little, I don't know if you can see her little name there. She signs it. Uh, but this is so cool. So she made me this accordion birthday card. What does it say? It's your day, hip, hip, hooray. A little birthday card. And I just love this. And, and so uh, in another Inspiration Daily, I was making, uh, I followed a, I shared with you one of my favorite Smash tutorial, tutorials that I found on YouTube. And so this stuff is actually, you know, paper engineering, it's, it's sculptural. So here's, so I could figure I can make a book like this and I can make a, a smash book and then I can make one of these books and then I put them together and it, and it becomes, it becomes sculpture. So that's, that's another template. I mean, so if you get a really cool birthday card and I'm at the stage where, you know, I don't, I used to collect when I was younger, I used to collect the cards that I had and go through them. But yeah, you know, again, at my age, I'm not doing that anymore. Can't take it with me. So that's another template. And then my last template, cause I'm, again, I'm going through the, the back room. <laughs> so this is, oh, so these are recycled. Can you see this? Oh yeah. These, I don't want to see the person's name, but these are recycled business cards. So I knew someone who was a physician in a practice and that person left the practice. Um, but I thought art supply <laughs> and I thought, let me do something with these. So I just, I had one of those cutters that, those die shaped cutters. And so it was a circular scissor and it was a punch and I just punched out the logo and they're kind of like, so I don't know, I look at these things and they remind me of, um, oh, the do not disturb signs in, in hotel rooms, uh, that you see hanging on, ho uh, in hotel rooms. So I don't know, but there's something that intrigues me about and so I feel, I don't know, I don't know what's going to happen, but, um, 
yes, I don't know what's going to happen, but that could be another template of sort. I'm not sure. I like playing with the possibilities of what a book can be. Uh, I'm also working on a cloth book. I have projects. I have projects. So yeah, bookmaking templates. There you go. Thanks for joining me.